Hi, Chase. I'll make this quick. Um, so I cut this pink coconut boutique interest. It was just high uh, cost per purchase, or I guess you can't see, but it just wasn't returning as well. Right. And Good. should I cut the pink lily boutique interest? What was the last few days? Let's see. Certainly, yeah. Yes. Interests okay. right now are getting hammered, uh, okay. just given you know everything that's going on. All right. Um, and then for, go I'm ahead sorry. and turn off your one percent initiate checkout. Okay. And go ahead and turn off your pink um, one percent checkout or one percent couture pixel. Uh, this one. Yeah, that's right. Okay. Any certain and reason why for that one? Because you have a 5% of it at the top. I did exclude the 1% and 2%. So do you want me to go in there and unexclude it? Yes. Okay. And I just launched that one about an hour ago. Great. So I'll go in and uh, do that. What about this US 5% purchase 30 days? Yeah, that's great. It looks like you just launched that one? Uh, no, uh, a couple of days ago, yeah. Uh, uh, I know it's it's not. Let me do lifetime. Yeah, it hasn't really got any spend. Right. So just wait and leave that. Yeah, you can. I mean, it might not perform at all. Just given that. I mean, have you tested a purchase thirty day before? Uh, yes. In that uh look alike. Yeah, I have. But I'll just watch it for a little while, and uh, okay. see. I I can't get to the where I tested it before. Yeah. But and then um, scale up your five percent for sure because you just cut those, so you'll want to increase the budget on the others. Okay, I have the campaign budget at two hundred thirty a day. She oh, okay. is she is do you think No, that's fine. That, that led me to another question. Um uh, every time I scale, I've scaled twice the past week. Like I scaled Sunday morning, which is hold on okay yesterday and we did terrible and so is that does that have anything to do with it uh click on your ad sets it's likely just an audience issue that's all it is because okay. you see how that one percent there you have yeah uh, you just need a five percent in the budget it, it, and you see how those realizes are higher on the on the larger percentages on the five yeah. percent yes you just need bigger audiences and that's the only issue you, when you're scaling at a one percent it, it doesn't work out okay so that's why mm -hmm. yeah okay. you just need a bigger audiences and now that you have them perfect yeah i did fix that so yeah okay. and you should go ahead and do the 30 day add to cart as a bigger audience as well like a three or five percent okay. for sure okay 30 day add to cart five percent look alike yeah all right and then turn off the one percent correct that's right that's right okay okay all right cool um as for the retargeting we're doing a lot better but i mean do you have any suggestions for what's the last that? few days look like let's see uh we'll do friday Yeah, create a separate campaign. Put your okay. page view 30 day, put your engaging with Instagram 365 and your Facebook page 180 day all in the same one. And then make this audience here initiate checkout and view content and add to cart combined and then just have the purchase next to it. Okay. So combine the page view 30 day the Instagram 365 days and the engage with Facebook past 180 days into all one audience. That's correct. Okay. And then the other one, the initiate checkout page view, add to cart and web view content into another audience. 
That's right. Yep. And that'll uh, consolidating that will really help your results and uh, prevent overlap, and you'll really be able to scale up a little bit better because now that you are scaling, you're going to need to consolidate down. Okay. Perfect. So a whole new campaign you said for that. That's correct. Okay. Cool. Well, I think that's it for today. So uh, thank you so much. Awesome, Cindy. Thank you. Okay. Thanks. Bye.